The People's Indigenous Rights Movement has called on the federal government to ensure the ongoing probe of the Niger Delta Development Commission, NDDC, is pursued to a logical end. The national coordinator of the group, Uche Okonkwo, spoke to newsmen in Abuja saying the ongoing allegations against the Ministry of the Niger Delta Affairs and the Minister Senator Gatsui Lakpabio has not been substantiated with factual documents and should not affect the probe. Mr. Okonkwo criticized the embattled former active chairperson of the Interim Management Committee, Joy Nunier, of playing to the gallery and trying to distract the public from the real issues underground. He says the movement is fully behind a forensic audit of the commission as it will unearth wide-scale corruption within the commission. It is pertinent to say that in all of the shouting, huffing and huffing, Mr. Sunde is yet to tender any document to the House of Reps, who by by the way, the chairman of the House Committee on NDDC, Onubini Tunji Ojo, is immersed in corruption allegations of having benefited with a 17-kilometer road contract. Why it is not, it, why it is not, it, why it is not cast in stone that some things may have gone wrong? Mrs. Nune and her co-travelers should allow the forensic audit ordered by President Muhammad Dubai to go on. It's only proper that any grievances and allegations of wrongdoing should be channeled to the audit panel and not the red herring all over the place. The new movement of the NDDC, the Internal Management Committee, and the Minister of the United Delta, St. Augustine Lagwabi, should be allowed some breathing space to reposition a terribly battered commission.